Yeah. We back again. Tron and Kimberly. Moses. Welcome to Team Moses Vlogs. Will you watch us do life? And enjoy marriage. On our journey. I love you. You love me. I love you. You love me. I got you back, baby. I got you back, baby. I love you. You love me. I love you. You love me. Do y'all know what today is? Today is burrito day in the Moses house. We are having... Hey baby, you ain't gonna speak to the team? 
We are having burrito day. She not smiling. I don't know what's going on. I know what's going on. It's burrito day in the Moses house. Yes. So we're going to make burritos. And that's what's up. We figured we'd bring y'all along. Some of y'all should have came by, you know. Got y'all burrito. All y'all welcome. Y'all welcome to come by the house. I ain't say y'all was coming in, but, you know, we might even call the police on y'all once y'all out of the yard. But we still love you. Don't come by without calling now. You know how black people is. They don't like nobody coming in their house without calling. Yeah. I had a cousin. She would not let you in her house. If you came to her house and you did not call, she would not open her door. She would look at you through the window and just stare at you till you leave. She would not open the door. She might be watching right now. I don't know. I don't know if she watched, but if you came to her house and you didn't call first, you was not getting in. And I don't care if you see her car in the yard. I don't care if you hear noise in the house. You ain't getting in. Call first. And it's good to call first because then you find out if a person want company or not. People don't always, I don't always want company. I'm going to be honest with you. I don't always want company. But sometimes I just feel like chilling and watching a movie or doing something on the computer. Yeah, I don't always feel like entertaining guests. But anyway, y'all, I'm getting off topic because today is Burrito Day. Right, babe? Yeah. And it's also Valentine's Day. So happy belated Valentine's Day to y'all. I pray y'all had a good one, an awesome one. Yeah. So we're all spending our Valentine's Day together. So it's burrito day for the four of us. We'll catch y'all later. All right, team. Anyway, we about to uh we about to make burritos. So we got we got chicken. The three meats we got is chicken, uh steak, and ground beef. So I think I'm gonna start with the chicken. My wife think I don't like chicken because I, I'll be eating her chicken. Now, look, if we really family, y'all keep what I just said between us now. Don't be telling people our business. Now. Don't be telling, you ain't got to tell my, my wife ain't got to know what I just said to y'all. But anyway, she around here um, seeing what the kids want. We usually don't eat dinner at about 5 o'clock and the kids will make snacks and stuff. But it's burrito day. We're going burrito till we go to sleep. Anyway. Got a little headache and stuff like that, so I'm kind of not really in it, amen. But yeah, I wrapped my burritos up there in the oven. Mines, I rolled them up good. The base, this is a little bit messy, yeah. But I'm about to take them out the oven now. Yeah, and then we got some chips. I didn't think we show you the chips, but we got some chips and all this dip. But yeah, so we have roasted red pepper, a hen and lime and like some chili garlic.
Anyway, what's up, team? Today is still burrito day. Oh, this is Pepsi, by the way. Hmm. Had that sparkling cider in it, but... Yeah, so right now we full. But you know what? I'm going to make me another one in a couple of hours. Make, I'm going to have me another one. Because mine, I didn't, I didn't wrap it right. I looked on Instagram and I seen plenty of... I seen them wrap it well. I seen on YouTube, I seen them wrap it. But I still messed up somehow. So... I'm going to do another one. And um, I'm going to do a video soon. I got some stuff I want to talk about. But anyway, we're going to keep this burrito day. I ain't going to talk about other stuff. Burrito day, Valentine's Day. That's why I'm wearing my rag. When God sends his lightning strikes, it hits the bullseye every time. It hits the target every time. In my dream, the enemy couldn't get close to me. He couldn't, he couldn't touch me because I was eating the word. That's a clue that we got to eat the word. You want the word of God to be electrifying through you? Eat the word. Prophetess, how can I eat the word? Study the word. Meditate on the word. Go back over the word. Reflect on the word. What does it mean to you? What is God saying to you out of the passage? Memorize these verses. Decree and declare the word. Read the word. You're eating the word. Take a break. Come back to the same passage. Get the word inside of your heart. Because the word is electrifying. His word is alive. And lightning strikes are being produced. So I'm going to put a little rice on there. Not too much rice. Put a little rice on there. Okay. Just a little bit of that right there. We got some steak, but I'm not going to get no steak right now. This chicken. I'm not ready for steak. Nobody has steak yet. Everybody had chicken. Mmm. Okay. What's next? What's this? Corn. All right, team. Piece of corn fell out my burrito. All right, anyway, team, that's about it. I pray y'all enjoy burrito then as much as we did. This burrito is fat. Hey, y'all have a bite? I'm gonna put this in the refrigerator. I'll have this later, probably tomorrow. Right now, team, y'all know what I want. I want a cold Pepsi. All right, I'll see y'all on the next one. Come here, pumpkin. We'll see y'all on the next one. <clears throat> this has been Burrito Day. Catch y'all on the next one. Deuces. I love you. You love me. I love you. You love me.
you love. 